Hey girls, so today I'm going to be showing you some products that I have been obsessing over lately and I'm really excited to let you guys know about them. So I was contacted by a company called Fortune Cookie Soaps a few months ago and I checked out their website just to see if it was something that I would like to try and tell you guys about. So I looked around and their products looked so unique and so fun. So I was really excited to try them and the first time I tried one of their products I was so surprised and so amazed by it and I fell absolutely in love with them. So after I first used one of their products I went online to see if anyone had done a review on them yet and I saw no reviews on this company and I was so shocked because their products are amazing but I realized it's probably because a lot of people don't know about their products. So I'm really excited to introduce you guys to this company. So I'm just going to get straight into it and I'm probably going to make this video two parts. So right now I'm just going to talk about their main products which is their soaps. And you can probably tell by their company name which is Fortune Cookie Soaps. Yes, their soaps are shaped like fortune cookies. And their soaps are $2.75 so they come in little bags like this. And this one is called Honeymoon in Paradise. So the first one looks like this. It's bright orange and as you can see it has a fortune in it. All of the soaps have fortunes in them and they have actual fortunes on the little piece of paper. So before I get into all the scents, first off I just want to say um, these lather so well. A lot of you guys are probably wondering how in the world am I going to rub this weirdly shaped soap on my body. And I actually personally just prefer to just rub it straight on my body. It's not like abrasive. It doesn't hurt or anything. You can just like rip pieces off if you want to and it works all the same. It lathers so well. It's not like a bubbly lather. It's more like a creamy moisturizing lather and I think everyone needs their skin to be moisturized. So I get about 18 uses out of one of these soaps which is crazy because when I first got these I thought I'd probably only get like two uses out of them but you can really get like 18 uses out of these. Um, I don't know, they just last so long. I actually bought a Lush soap not too long ago that was like $18 for one chunk and I got like 12 uses out of it. So you can only pay like $2.75 for an amazing soap and get like 18 uses out of it. And I'm not even over exaggerating, you can really get that many uses out of the soap, it's amazing. So now that I let you guys know how they work, I'm just going to show you the scents really fast. So like I said, this one is Honeymoon in Paradise and it smells like guava, papaya, pineapple, and coconut and it does smell like all of those things. But it definitely smells a lot more like coconut and pineapple, so I really like that one. And also, if you pay 25 cents more, instead of getting the little bag, you can actually get either a black little takeout box, a red little takeout box, or a white one. And you can also get a clear one, which I didn't get a clear one, but I personally like the colored ones better. So they're really good for like party favors or gifts for your friends, and they're really cheap too. They make amazing Mother's Day gifts, especially for the people who can't like spend a whole bunch of money for a holiday. The next one is Caramel Apple, and it looks like this. It's just green, and it looks like it was dipped in caramel. It smells so amazing. Next one is Blue Cotton Candy, which is a light blue, and it smells just like Blue Cotton Candy. The scent isn't that strong on this one. Some of the scents are stronger than others. The next one is Cherry Cordial. I think that's how you say it. It's supposed to smell like a chocolate covered cherry. And I don't actually like the scent of this one. It's just not like my type because I don't really like chocolate scents. But if you do, then you will really like that scent. Violet Raspberry, which is a really pretty like violety purple. And it has like a drizzled light pink on top. It smells so amazing. I normally don't like floral scents, but this smells so good. I really like that for spring and summer. This one is really good for a Mother's Day gift because it smells like really floral and springy. I really like that one. The next one is Strawberries and Champagne. And this one is actually one that I've used about nine times already. And so as you can see, it looks a little bit worn out because I have used it a lot. But there's still a lot left and I've used this like nine times. So... I really like that one. It smells just like strawberries and champagne. And some of them you will notice have like little exfoliating beads in them. So that's really good. It doesn't hurt your skin. It's really exfoliating. It just takes all the dead skin off. The next one is chocolate dipped strawberry. And I got this one in a little takeout box. They're so cute. So it's just red and it has the little black spots on it for a strawberry. And then it looks like it was dipped in chocolate and it has like white drizzles on top. This smells so amazing. The red does smell like a strawberry and then the brown does smell like chocolate. And I like it because this chocolate scent isn't like really overpowering like the other one. It actually smells really good. 
And the next one is Hazelnut Cappuccino. And this one is actually really amazing. It smells just like hazelnut cappuccino and it looks like this. Now this is like the number one soap that I want to eat. I want to eat them all but I really want to eat this one because it looks so amazing. Oh my gosh, I want to eat it but I won't. Pink Power and this is like their breast cancer awareness one. So it is just like pink and it smells like a tutti frutti jelly bean to me. It's like really fruity. It's really good, so I really recommend getting this one because it's for breast cancer awareness, so I really like that one. The next one is Jack Frosty, and this is like one of my favorites. So it is just silver, and as you can see, it has glitter in it. And I love anything that has to do with like glitter, so I love this one. This one smells like peppermint and candy canes. It smells so amazing. And then I saved the best for last because this is my favorite one, and this one is called Oatmeal Cookies. And I love it so much because it smells amazing. And just look at this. So as you can see, it's kind of like a light transparent color. And it has oats in it. So it's going to exfoliate your skin. And I love exfoliating products, like I said. It smells like oatmeal cookies. Oh my gosh. And if you have tried the Little Lush Pud Bath Bomb from Lush that was in the holiday collection, it smells just like that, which I don't know why it smells like pudding. But... Oh my gosh, this smells amazing. If you can only get one soap, I would really recommend getting this one because it just is going to exfoliate your skin. It's a really natural smelling soap. It's my favorite. All time, out of all the soaps I got, this is my favorite. I really like it. Okay, so moving on, some other products they have on the website are bath bombs. And I actually was sent two bath bombs, but I used one of them. So the one that I have left is actually called Strawberry Fields. And this one is $4.00 which is not that expensive, so it just has like directions on the back of how you use it, but it's kind of pretty obvious how you would use it. And then on the front it just says Fortune Cookie Soaps and the name of it. So it looks like this, and it actually kind of looks like a watermelon, and it's supposed to be like a strawberry, but it's still really cute. So it's just pink and it has green on the top, and it smells just like a watermelon. It smells like watermelon and strawberries, but look at how cute that is. It's like pink and green, two of my favorite colors. This is the perfect scent for spring and summer. And the bath bombs are really good. You just pop them in your tub. They make the strongest scent in your bath. It just makes your whole bathroom smell so yummy. And you can smell it when you get it out of the bath. You can smell it on your skin. So that's really good. And it's just really amazing. So I like that. Okay, and some other products that they have are really similar to their bath bombs. These are called their gelatos. And I got two of them. So I got chocolate mint. And basically they're supposed to look like ice cream. Well, they're supposed to look like gelato, I guess. So they're supposed to look like gelato. And they just come in a little ice cream container. It has like the ice cream texture. And it comes with a spoon. How cute is that? So you can just like break it off and put it in your bath. And it works basically just like a bath bomb. And it has a really strong scent. And the other one I got was pink watermelon. So I didn't use the chocolate mint one yet, but I have used this one, even though it doesn't look like it. You don't really need that much for your bath because these are so strong smelling. But this one is just pink, and this is my favorite one. It smells very, like, sweet and watermelony, so I really like these. They're just very cute. I have never seen something like that before. It looks like ice cream. Oh my gosh, I want to eat it, but it smells really yummy, so I really recommend checking these out. And I believe the gelatos are $6. Don't, like, quote me on that, but I think they are $6. So this is part one, and I'm going to film part two right now. I just kind of wanted to break it up so it wouldn't be, like, that long of a video. So in part two, I'm going to talk about all the other fun products, so I will have a link where you can watch that.